Hey what's going on guys, it's Combo here, today I'm bringing you guys some Call of Duty Black Ops 4 on the PS4. I'm going to be using the Rampart Assault Rifle in this game, this was from a little while ago, and uh, as you notice it's from theater mode so I do apologize for that. I wasn't recording when this um, gameplay took place, but I do think it's one of my best games on Black Ops 4 so far, and I'm really actually enjoying Black Ops 4, and I'm surprised at how well I'm doing in the game I guess, um, and the biggest Thing I should mention right off the bat is that I play pretty much exclusively hardcore. I don't really play core um, because of the the very high time to kill. I don't really enjoy that aspect of Black Ops uh, 4. I think it's kind of I don't know. It's I don't know. I, I just I'm just not a fan of it. And then the healing also kind of gets annoying because you can shoot somebody like five or six times and then they can just duck behind cover, heal up, and then take you down. So I, I just usually stick to hardcore where pretty much healing is essentially eliminated. You can still heal with uh, if you're running the stim shot, but other than that, um, and it's rare that you will even survive uh, one or two bullets that is, is needed to kill you in hardcore. So I usually just stick to hardcore. Kill confirmed is my game type. And uh, yeah, so I, I, I get a really nice score in here. This is a nice action-packed gameplay. And I think because Black Ops 4, you your character moves so fast, you can get around the map so fast. And I think it really fits my playstyle, kind of. I always like rushing. Um, I just run around the map all the time. As the years go on with Call of Duty, I get progressively less patient. <laughs> Each Call of Duty that comes out, I just want to rush more. Um, and it's not really a good thing in most cases because I do have considerable gun skill and I probably could pull off much better gameplays and much better scores have better stats, that kind of stuff, but I just really like rushing and just, I, I don't really have the patience to hide behind cover or, or like head glitch or anything like that, but to each their own, I just like moving around the map, trying to get a high score per minute as I can. Um, so this gameplay, you'll kind of see that, and uh, it's on Slum, so you guys might recognize this map if you don't have Black Ops 4 from Black Ops 2 on the Wii U. Um, this was a great map, I love every time it comes up, same with firing range in this game. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the gameplay. I hope you guys enjoy the action-packed one. It's pretty quick. It's only already like halfway over. Um, but I just wanted to talk a little bit about 2019, what kinds of stuff I'm going to be doing, and all that kind of stuff. So um, obviously I'm going to be making the yearly like status videos for all of the Call of Duty games on Nintendo consoles. So like Black Ops 2 and Ghosts and you know Modern Warfare 3. Black Ops 1 on the Wii. I'm going to let you guys know how many people are still playing those games and stuff like that. Um, and hopefully those videos will come out within the earlier portion of the year and that kind of stuff. Um, I don't really know what else I'm going to be uploading this year. Hopefully some more science videos and things like that. But I usually do um, at the turn of the new year. Happy New Year, by the way. I usually make a video um, asking about what your guys... Um, New Year's resolution is and if you don't have one I would encourage you to make one um, and try to stick to it. So the last couple years I made that kind of video. I didn't make one this year but I guess this is it will kind of serve that point. So um, let me know in the comments below if you made a New Year's resolution what it is and um, how you're doing with it so far. Um, I made a couple New Year's resolutions. This year I want to plant at least 50 trees and that's going to be somewhat of a challenge. I do um, grow plants or grow trees from seed. Whenever I pick up seeds, I try to germinate them um, on my own and then try to find somewhere to plant them. So I do have like 10 trees growing in my backyard that I can just plant wherever. But it's going to be a challenge to come up with the other and try to complete that goal for 2019 as well um, and things like that. But I think it's possible, and I think it would be a cool little challenge and cool little thing to do to plant 20 or to plant 50 trees by the end of this year. Um, I also wanted to start journaling, and that kind of sounds weird, um, but I have been told that journaling actually helps a lot with reflecting on what's going on in your life, helps you absorb things better, and helps you process your emotions a little bit better. And in the first semester of grad school, I definitely need something to help me, like, um, reflect on what's going on and kind of take it all in and try to um, figure out what um, is going on and that kind of stuff. So I'm going to try to journaling as well um, each 
at least three or four times a week and just kind of write down what's going on in my life and all that good stuff. But that's pretty much the gameplay. I hope you guys enjoy it. Thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video.